the capital of fashion, romance, and beauty. But it's also the world's center for cooking and baking. Paris is the, not only the center of European baking, uh, it is the center of and the beginnings of true gourmet baking and pastry. All of that is very exciting to VIU professional baking program instructor Martin Barnett and his students as they get ready to embark on a field trip to visit Paris in March. We're going to Paris for uh, Europan 2012 which is a, an exposition and series of competitions in Paris, France and it's the biggest show of its kind. I am so excited. Uh, Paris has always been like one of those really far out there dreams, you know, that you have that you really wanna, really wanna get to. And being in Paris for baking is just, just the epitome of cool. I am so stoked. I have never been to Europe before. So being able to go to Paris and, and for such an event too, like European, and uh, where it's uh, such a huge deal. There's gonna be, you know, all the newest equipment, the, the best ingredients, the best chefs are gonna be there. This will be the first time baking students take part in a field trip of that magnitude. This 10-month program, which trains pastry chefs and bakers, has seen a huge increase in enrollment this year. This is the first year that we've taken uh, 36 students into the program because we've doubled our cohort because uh, recruitment has been uh, so successful and so many young people want to get into the trade right now. Josie Franson came all the way from Golden, BC to take part in this program and she's really been enjoying the curriculum so far. Nanaimo's like a lot like home. There's a lot of wilderness. It's really beautiful. Another selling point was definitely like a 10-month program then I can like get on with my life and I mean it's not you're not committing to a program for so long. We've had uh, eight weeks so far of pastry, uh, working with pies and savory items, um, different types of bars, cookies, cakes, cake decorating. We've also just, we're right in the middle now of uh, an eight week section worth of breads, which I have never done before, so it's a completely new learning experience for me. 23 students, six alumni and five staff members are hoping to get to Paris and they're continuing to fundraise to make their dream of visiting the City of Lights a reality. In Nanaimo, for Shaw TV, I'm Junia Tozzi. Viva France!